to kill Cam back on the saddle of the gunner, aka the tank, and excuse the super squinting today. I gotta go grow my chicken legs. It's leg day, and I only have not too much time before I have to go into work today. So I'm gonna do like three birds with one stone. I'm gonna enjoy my ride, I'm gonna make a little video, and I gotta go get the gym in before work. So gotta take the gunner. thing just wakes you up for the gym. Uh, no pre-workout in me. <laughs> uh, already hyper, man. Let's go. When you're on a time crunch and you're hyper to go to the gym, oh man. <laughs> and don't be too alarmed. The gym isn't too far. I know I'm squinting pretty hard right now, but it's just down the road. Go get that done. Thank you. Go get that done and just go shower back before work. Probably gonna get rained on so I get a free shower. That's pretty lit. Man, they build this they built this gas station. Not this gas station, this was a big ass car wash. I don't know if you guys can see that with this uh E-class right there. How you doing? Oh see they know. <laughs> they just know. 106. Hey my boy knows. He goes, it's not 106 displacement. So do you, man. That's awesome. Thank you, bro. I'm telling you guys, the gunner just comes out and breaks next. That guy obviously knew what he was talking about if he already knew the engine size. And I don't think he could have read the 106 on the engine from how far away he was. So, just props to that guy. I think this might be back-to-back -back gunner videos. I apologize. I try to switch it up as you guys know. I'm not turning into a cruiser channel just yet. Still got the R6 in there. The OG baby. I know you guys like these videos though. But when I hop on the uh, the gunner and the Vulcan. It's been a minute, man. Work's been so busy. We have so many events coming up and that we've been dealing with. It's ridiculous. It's nice even just to take the bike to the gym. In theory, what I normally used to do when I only had the R6 and my dad didn't even ride is I would actually wear jeans, have the shaker cup in the backpack. I would think I would throw a pre-workout in there sometimes just so I didn't have to take it before I rode. I don't know if any of you guys do that. But that's a normal, that's my normal setup. I would have a change of clothes, tank top, shorts, and I just wear jeans and a t-shirt, go change and change back out and then hop on the bike. Because I won't get on the R6 without real pants, at least jeans at least. So I don't know if you guys lift it all and ride. I'm pretty sure it goes like hand in hand in that same douche bag category or being a tool category. But I don't know, I feel like they're comparable, relatable, whatever whatever you want to say here. But yeah, I used to just literally just rock a backpack, shake your cup, bring pre-workout, and that's all I, all I normally took. Bring your wallet. Right now, I do the uh, the Kill Cam Squid Special. I got my wallet in my sock. Yeah, you do what you gotta do. Squid life. <laughs> Revving in a hallway, loud as anything. I'm trying not to curse, man. I noticed that in my videos, I, I say like at least two or three words a video. I'm trying to cut that down to like the occasional one. I honestly don't even curse that much in real life, unless I like have to, which you don't really have, hey, you know what I mean. I'm cutting that back, but it's time to go attempt to get swole. Ooh, I got the front seat in the house. Time to go attempt to get swole. Gotta put these steroids to use. You guys know what I'm talking about. Let's get it. Oh man, in and out real quick. Whew. Ain't nothing like sweating on the inside, coming out outside, and getting on this hot bike. We do what we gotta do. Let them know. Man, already feeling better. Even if I could only go there for like 30 minutes, you still, half the battle's just getting to the gym, man. Once you're there, 
you can even have a bad workout but as long as you went that's still a victory and i'm ready for this cooler weather to come you guys i know you guys are kind of dreading it up north i know a lot of you guys that have to put the bikes away i feel bad for you guys man oh and speaking of the comments one of the kill fam one of my boys my last video on the gunner i had a deer run out in front of me i don't know if you guys saw that and he was like deer are my biggest problem here i have to deal with deal with moose and bears and i was like what in the world that's wild no pun intended and look at this douchebag and I don't even want to take the time to bleep out what language I just said to that guy for pulling out in front of me. Here I was just talking about deer and moose and bears. You still have to worry about the, the typical cable guy. <laughs> Be careful out there for you boys that are riding. I know, I know a lot of you guys do. Man, I apologize. Not too long of a video today. I just want to let you guys know, man, I've been busy with work. Just non-stop events this week. And believe me, I want to be riding so bad. That's all I think about at work. Those of you that ride, you know what I'm talking about. You walk into work and you're just like, man, I'd rather be doing this. I want you guys to enjoy your weekend or week or whatever. I'll see you guys before the weekend. But y'all take it easy. Kill Cam out.